But now you're probably familiar with creating Emmet HTML. So something like dot warning will create you a div p dot hello paragraph of the class of hello. That's another video. You're probably comfortable with that by now. However, how do you use those when you actually already have the content? Uh, now Sublime Text has a built-in kind of wrap with tag uh, where it gives you some really basic stuff. You're able to kind of just uh, select your text and wrap it in a tag. However, if you need to give it a class or an attribute or anything like that, you're, you're kind of out of luck. Uh, you need to do that manually. So instead of using the built-in Sublime Text wrapping feature, we actually use the Emmet wrapping feature, which is much more flexible. And it's actually going to fit into your workflow if you're comfortable with uh, working with Emmet. So the way we do that is we just go ahead and select something and now the keyboard shortcuts for Mac and Windows are actually totally different in this case. Uh, so on Windows it's going to be Control Shift G and on the Mac it's going to be Control W. So uh, go ahead and hit Control W. Make sure you don't hit Command W which will actually close the window. Uh, so Control W and I want to draw your attention down to the bottom right here where it says enter wrap abbreviation. So by default, that will probably be empty. And now we can go ahead and type any Emmet abbreviation that we're familiar with before. So uh, the obvious one being just P will give us a P tag. You can see it's been wrapped in a paragraph T tag. Uh, I could do P dot hello and it will give it a class. Um, I could give it an attribute of data dash name equals Wes and all of that will be in. When you're done, just go ahead and hit enter uh, and it'll pop your cursor right back inside of there. So I'll just show you again, warning, warning, maybe that will be a span with a class of warning. Hit control W span dot warning, type it down here, right here it's auto completed a span with a class of warning. View more works with attributes as well, control W. Uh, a ref square brackets equals about.html. Now this works really, really nicely if you have multiple cursors. So I'm just going to go ahead and select all of them. It's another video if you want to uh, learn how to do that. Select them all, hit control W. Now when I type in my abbreviation, I can type li, puts an li around all of them. Uh, and we can even do dot item, of course. But if you put dollar sign in there, uh, it's going to use that and swap it out with the increment. So one, two, three, four, five. Uh, so a really handy way to wrap your tags, uh, much better than the built-in one.